Hello everybody, welcome back to another chat GPT tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to write a pretty damn good essay using chat GPT. Now, I want to make known up front here, I do not condone cheating, I do not recommend cheating, and I don't like plagiarism, but chat GPT is an incredibly useful tool for helping you write an essay, but you can't just copy paste it or you're doomed and you're going to get caught plagiarizing, you might get evicted, kicked out of your school, whatever could happen. So with that out of the way, here's how you can use it as a tool. So here is an example. You can write, you could, you could just type into ChatGPT, write a 500 word essay on Macbeth like this. But here's the problem. It's going to give you a general essay. What you want to do is do this. I did write a 2000 word essay on how the witches impact Macbeth. Argue that Macbeth is a victim of fate and his murder of Duncan was preordained. Provide references. This is a very specific um, request. I'm not just asking for a generic, e uh, generic essay like I did here. You have to ask and ask exactly what it is you want. And then you're going to get a great response like this. You'll even see here that it has references. So, I mean, that might not be enough references for you, but that... It, there's some references there and you can ask for more or you can ask, uh, you know, let me see, um, what are some, provide further ideas for references I can review. I'll write that in, I'll, I'll hit enter when this one's done. And then I'm going to show you another example of a more specific way to write a, a, an essay. So there we go. We got some references there. Good, good, good. I'm going to hit enter as soon as it's done. That should be the end of it. There we go, hit enter, this is gonna write it out. Now, let's go back to my other example. In this example, let's go right up to the top. I said write a 1,000 word essay, exactly the same thing. Okay, you're probably following along with me. Here's my 1,000 word essay, here are my references. But now, based on what it wrote here, it basically goes thesis, topic one, topic two, topic three, conclusion. So the topic one is, let's see here, um, idea that Macbeth is a victim of fate. Something, 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 something. So what did I do here? I went in and said, elaborate on how Macbeth is a victim of fate. I asked it very specifically to elaborate on that key point. It then provided me with another 750 or so words on that key point. So I can copy and paste that, or I can rewrite that, or more importantly, I can just put that into a document and then think about it and then go and get my own references and my own ideas. So there's the one. The second part of the essay would be this one here. How does, uh, let's see here, what is it? How does, yeah, how do the witches make Macbeth feel invincible? And how does that impact things? So I go elaborate on how the witches make Macbeth feel invincible. Here we go. The witches in Macbeth make in feel invincible through their prophecy that he will not be harmed by any a man of woman board. Very no well-known fact of the play. It provides very specific references in terms of act two, scene one. Macbeth directly states. So you're getting incredible information here. And then the third premise or the third part that I wanted to elaborate on is elaborate on the role the witches play in the murder of King Duncan. This all comes out of the front here. This comes out of the first essay. So, and this is the third and final point. How do they play a significant role in the murder of King Duncan? Bam. I take all of this stuff. I put it into a Word document like this. And then I add my references in and you've got an essay. Of course, rewrite it, rethink it, add your own references, do your thing. Quick add on here. Here is what I got when I asked it for re additional references that I could find helpful in my study of Macbeth. And it gives you a nice long list here of different books, critical essays, guides, etc. that you could look into. This is how you create an awesome essay with the help of ChatGPT. Thanks for watching.